I'm in the mountains outside of Vancouver, British Columbia. And as you know, Canadians drive on the left just as we do in the States. I'm in a right-hand drive car. But that's not the only unusual thing about this Mazda. This is an advanced prototype for what Mazda is calling their Sky Active technology. Sky Active is the, our Mazda new, complete new technology for futures. Of course, we had a lot of the uh, severe condition for uh, CO2 reduction or fuel economy for each region, North America, Europe, Japan, everywhere. We have to reduce dramatically uh, for CO2 emission and fuel economy. Therefore, we decided to develop a completely new technology for all of the vehicles. But we are a master. Therefore, we have to maintain zoom, zoom, fun to drive feeling. Therefore, this both requirement must be met. The way Mazda met those engineering challenges was to redesign six key elements that, among other things, take weight out of the car to increase both fuel economy and to decrease emissions. So when they're released, Skyactiv vehicles will offer one of two new engines, a gasoline or a diesel, two new transmissions, a manual and an automatic, as well as a new body and a new chassis. Everything lighter, stronger, and more efficient than current models. I think Skyactiv is a way that we can reinforce our engineering prowess. In other words, it can reinforce what we stand for as a company and and we are an engineering company that just happens to sell cars I think sometimes is the way it feels and that'll reinforce that with the consumers and it'll reinforce our image and, and it'll give us uh, kind of some small company creed that uh, you know maybe today our racing gives us but this engineering will develop and continue to push that along. Sky Active fits perfectly within Mazda's legacy of groundbreaking, iconoclastic engineering. Things like the rotary engine and the reinvention of the affordable sports car with the Miata. This prototype is our first taste of what's to come. Up next, the freshened Mazda 3 with the Sky Active engine and Sky Active transmission. That'll be followed by the first full Sky Active Mazda, the CX-5 in 2012. In Vancouver, British Columbia, I'm Isaac Bouchard with AutoLine. Drivers who want to get the most out of their cars, it's Bridgestone or nothing.